will walk through or he'll walk through different corridors, but it's what he recognises. It's what used to be known to him. Okay? But he, my guy is trying to show me like um, a hallway with lots and lots of doors. So I'm seeing doors, lots and lots of doors on either side. And I feel like, you know, we've got the numbers on all, all the doors here. He's like, show me all number of doors. And he keeps showing me 62. It's just a place he would have been. He's also trying to, 13 is one of the lucky but he keeps giving me the 13. But he's talking about being in the basement. Right. Is there anything else I tell you? Or anything like that around this near here? Here? Or is it part of this area? Um, yeah, part of this area um, is was a hotel. Because they're trying to give me this feeling of the numbers I'm seeing is like the hotel numbers. Mm -hmm. Okay? So it feels like either this area here was where we are now, or around in this area is like all the hotels. Okay? So it feels like you know, this gentleman is, is part of this place. He haunts what used to be that place. But who wants this now? Because it's still his place as far as he's concerned. And he's, he's quite a character. He's, he's quite a hard man, actually. He's not so nice. He's not pleasant. No, he's not. No, he's not. He's quite intimidating. Um, you know the guys have had troubles in the time, you know, where they've been walking around these, these tunnels through doorways, like they've been followed. Yeah. Because he was under following. Right. Okay, he was under following. Um, and he does it just purely out of intimidation. It isn't just the fact that he's really enjoying it, he's maliciously enjoying it. It's not like, oh, I'm just enjoying it, it's fun. He's maliciously enjoying it. It's like, get, he's really getting off on it. Mm -hmm. You know, that he can throw the life out of people. Um, but he'll make people feel quite well. If he comes too close, he can make him feel a little sick sometimes as well. It's where his energy is quite a nice energy. You know, and I don't expect he's probably a nice person on this side of life. And that's why he's, um, that's why he's so intimidating from the spiritual side of things. He's grounded here. He's crossed over, um, but he, it's like he's stuck here, and he doesn't want to go anywhere else. He doesn't want to go to, you know, if you want to call it heaven or spirit, or he doesn't want to go there. He's happy where he is. Um, he's, he's, a, he's a grounded spirit. He's, he's a stuck spirit. So that's where the hauntings come from. You know, in, in his energy, he could cause, you know, um, things to move, things to shift. He could break things, knock things over. You know, he's, he's quite a strong energy. Okay. Not one to be uh, broken with.